Columns of smoke rise on the horizon in Tianjin Friday from fires still burning after two massive chemical blasts in the port city. At least 54 people were killed and more than 700 injured when a warehouse storing toxic substances blew up on Wednesday night. Friends of those injured or missing await news at a local hospital. <laughs> Wang Jinbao's son, a firefighter, was injured. We don't know exactly what happened to them, he said. We came here yesterday when we heard about the blasts. Information has indeed been thin on what caused the incident. Police say the warehouse was designed to contain dangerous chemicals, including ammonium nitrate, potassium nitrate, and calcium carbide. Still, investigators said Friday there are just too many details that are unknown. There's a lot about the situation on the ground that's not very clear. Exactly what the pollutants, uh, what exploded, also what there is, we don't know. If the situation is not clear, we can't clearly determine exactly what kind of pollutants were emitted into the air when the explosion or accident happened. The explosions were so big they were seen by satellites in space and registered on earthquake sensors. Foreign companies from around the world were trying to determine the damage to their facilities in and around the port, which is the world's 10th largest.